Welcome back, welcome back. We're back to week 11, one more week after this. It can't get more excited. Well, actually, you know, it could be more exciting when you're done, all right? But when you're done, that doesn't mean you're finished. You can keep working out and keep pushing through, all right? So even though we're at the end, we're still gonna do a nice, simple move. We're gonna stay up the ground, stay up here, and really work those hip flexors on this one, okay? So what we're gonna do, we're gonna do a small squat with a front kick. Actually, we're gonna have a real kick, okay? So watch what it looks like. Some of you that fight, you might know the defensive stance. We're gonna keep our hands up, and if you don't fight, you're gonna learn something today. You're gonna keep your hands up, feet just about inside shoulder width, okay? Just about inside shoulder width. So it's a little bit tighter stance. From here, you're gonna squat down, come up, and kick. That's balance, all right? Squat down, come up, kick with the other leg. That's what's happening there. When you do that, you're engaging your hip flexors every time you bring your legs up. And just like we did with every other squat, you're engaging your glutes, quads, and calves for stability as you do that squat. So watch, squat down, kick balance. Squat down, kick for balance, okay? If you can't balance like this, normally for yourself, use something at home to hold on to for that squat and for that balance here, okay? Let's do it all together. So hands up for some balance. Okay, hey, don't, don't look too mean, okay? <laughs> don't look too mean for hands up. Let's keep those smiles on faces. What we're gonna do, we're gonna start with that right leg. Your left leg, ready, go, down, kick, that's it, down, <sighs> breathe, down, bang, down, good, left and right is one, remember that, bang, down, this is three for us, <sighs> small exercise, really feel it in those quads right here, down, bang, last time, down, good, relax. Next move we're gonna do, we're gonna work on those hip flexors going out to the side. So if you have stuff, stuff in your area, don't kick anything. Should have told you that before, but I'm telling you now, don't kick nothing. All right, what you're gonna do, same thing, small squat. It's gonna be a small squat, extend out. That's gonna work all this. Sorry, fellas, it's a glute machine right now. Squat down, kick out. You really work on those hip flexors. And again, for those steps, depending on how much or how far you're stepping, that's really helping with your gait and your balance, okay? So we're gonna squat down, open up. Squat down, other side, same principle. Very simple, very effective. Do enough of these and you'll really feel that burn all around your hip region, okay? Really working those hip flexors. All right, let's do it all together. Working that to our right side first, your left side. Okay, hands on your hips. Ready, go, down. Open, good, down. Other side, nice, down, Whew. down, good, down, open, down, <sighs> breathe, down, open, nice, down, yep, one more each side, boom, last one for us, good, relax, this is week 11, you're doing 10, we just did a demonstration, you keep on pushing, do it every other day, three sets, 10 reps each. You're really gonna feel the progress, really gonna feel a difference in the way that you walk and the way that you're getting those steps in, as well as increasing your personal activity. I'm excited for you, see you next week.